Donovan McNabb, you're tuned in to Out of Bounds. I'm Robert Griffin III, and you're tuned in to Out of Bounds. Black History Month, man. Blackness. When, when y'all think about black quarterbacks, man, and, and what y'all done and in, uh, inspiring this new generation, so many black quarterbacks in the league now, what does that mean to y'all when y'all look out on the field and see a Patrick Mahomes and see a Jalen Hurts and Justin Fields and all these other guys? Acceptance. Appreciation. Uh, the, the talent in which we've seen right now, we've seen that for over the last 20, 30 years. But now people are starting to appreciate the things that we bring to the table. And not only that, we're creating offenses that are based around our strengths and we improve our weaknesses. So when we build talent around us, all of a sudden it starts to flourish. But this isn't anything that we haven't seen over the years. So continue to watch, continue to enjoy, and flourish in this moment because this is going to continue to grow. Oh, he had that prepared. Uh. Didn't he? he was ready. <laughs> oh, he stood down on that one. Um, listen, I, I've had conversations with Donovan about this before. What was frowned upon in the past is now the standard. They're no longer telling not just black quarterbacks, but quarterbacks that have attributes of what the black quarterbacks had that they can't play the position anymore. So for me, that's the I find a lot of gratitude in that. They're not just taking guys and trying to put them in a West Coast system. They're taking that guy and building the system around what he does best. Right. And that to me is the true testament of the league developing and growing and what better day to have it, or what better month to have it than being Black History Month with a guy like Patrick Mahomes doing his thing out there and a guy like Brock Purdy who has attributes True. of the former black quarterbacks with the athleticism playing the Super Bowl.